Hey everyone, hope you're well. Uh, it's August already, uh, time for a Microstock earnings report uh, for July. So let's just jump right into it right now. So I always start with Adobe stock. Currently my lifetime position on Adobe stock is 7,760. Um, I have 9,102 images in my portfolio. I have 473 videos and I have 1,531 AI generated illustrations now. So my total sales for July were 364 assets. 363 of those were images, including uh, illustrations and one video sold for the month. So uh, pretty good for July, which is usually a slower month. Uh, of the 363 images, 85 were AI generated illustrations. So AI tends to be or continues to be a good chunk of my portfolio, so happy about that. But as far as sales go, the photos earned $281.39 for an RPD of $0.78, cents, and the single video that sold earned $7.56. Uh, and, so, and so as far as images go, uh, the video that sold was this time lapse of a rural church in Alberta. And my top three earning images were this uh, photo of surfboards in Waikiki, which earned me $6.62. Uh, this shot of the front of a cruise ship, which we were on, which earned $6.27. And this Calgary Skyline photo, which is one of my top selling photos, it earned $4.63. Okay, let's move to Shutterstock. Uh, my port size for Shutterstock is 11,975 images and 998 videos. I had 293 downloads in July, uh, not a bad amount. Image sales were 292 and video sales, just a single video. Uh, the images earned me $112.63 and the video earned me $3.31. The RPD on the images was 39 cents. So uh, kind of a low uh, royalty per download, I think, um, which sort of resulted in not a great amount despite the sales being, um, or at least the sales numbers being fairly consistent with normal, uh, no big uh, extended license sale. So uh, that's what happens when you don't get any of those. Uh, the 10 cents and the 15 cents and the, those kind of sales don't add up to much actually. Um, is what it is. Uh, the best sale I had was this photo of Calgary. It's a panoramic image of Calgary and it earned $14.40. Okay, let's talk about iStock. My port size on iStock is 7,038 images. I have 170 videos there. I had 166 total sales. That earned me $78.04 for a royalty, royalty per download of 47 cents. Uh, nine of those sales were videos, and those nine sales added up to $7.45 in total earnings. Nothing really exciting on iStock, actually. Um, seemed kind of like a blah month. The top three earnings sales were this skyline photo of Calgary, which you just saw. Uh, this overhead kind of shot at the Hawaiian Hilton uh, Waikiki beach area. And this third one is a Microsoft logo on an office building, actually taken in Vancouver. Um, it's probably my best-selling photo that I've taken in Vancouver, actually. Uh, so <laughs> take it for what it's worth. Okay, so let's move on to Dreams Time now. My port size on Dreams Time is uh, 13,536 images. I have 380 videos there. I had uh, 341 sales, all images. Uh, earnings were for those sales were $123.15 and the RPD there was 36 cents. So if you followed my videos in the past, my earnings reports for Microstock, uh, 341 sales at Dreams Time and $123 worth of earnings is should strike you as a bit unusual. Uh, that's not how my earnings reports usually go. 
uh, looked like someone went through um, a whole bunch of Alberta related images and downloaded all of those, almost all of those in one day, which was really odd. I don't think I've seen anything like that in my history, at least on Dreams Time. So I'd be curious if anyone had any thoughts about what's going on here, if it's just you know, someone just wanted those or what, but, um, and they were, a lot of them were older and not very good images, quite frankly. So, uh, that was weird, but, um, it was $123. So I'll take that weird. Okay. Let's move to Alamy now. I have 12,005 images on my Alamy portfolio. I had three sales. The gross on that was $77 and two cents and the net was $30 and 80 cents. So, uh, no partner sales, so just um, just the 60% Alamy commission on those. Uh, the best selling or the most valuable image for that month was this police car in Houston. It's kind of weird, but I always, whenever I'm traveling, I always try to shoot emergency vehicles like police cars or, or whatever, or ambulances, because there seems to be a market for that stuff, especially police cars. I've sold police car images from a number of cities around. Uh, that I photograph. So um, travel doesn't just have to be uh, attractions and sites. It can be all kinds of things um, that, that exist in cities that you don't live in. So um, take a broad interpretation of travel photography when you're out traveling around. Okay, Pond 5 um, images, 7,796 images in my portfolio. I have 1,974 videos there. I had two video sales. They earned me uh, $67.78, no image sales. Uh, the videos were of this uh, busy departures area of Gatwick Airport. And uh, the second video that sold was just a video of the grounds of the Calgary Stampede. Okay, deposit photos, I have uh, 11,147 assets there. I had 114 sales and that earned me $33.25. So over 33, over 30 is a good month for me on deposit. Um, it's kind of random deposit photos, but uh, not a big earner. Okay, black box. Uh, I have 146 assets there, I haven't uploaded there. Uh, just based on my current video strategy, uh, hasn't been, uh, something that's become core to my uh, current strategy as of yet. Okay, the next um, site that I'm gonna talk about is Motion Array, actually. I have 230 assets there now. Um, a mix of video and photos, more videos, but not tons more, uh, but just 230 assets, so keep that in mind. So I had 85 downloads in July, and that earned me $12, so, uh, even though the downloads are high and the amount's small, uh, for a portfolio of 230 um, videos and photos, that $12 I think is actually pretty high. So that's interesting about Motion Array. Um, I'm not sure if it'll trail off really quick or if I was getting those sales because you kind of get more when you have fresh assets uploaded. So I'm not gonna upload this month to see what happens, whether it trails off or or whatever because I just want to see how it works um, but uh, motion array looks like it might be a good uh, site to use a lot of the images or sorry videos that sold were things that I have uploaded elsewhere because you don't have to be exclusive that uh, doesn't sell so um, uh, stuff that I've uploaded that I've, has never sold has sold on motion array so uh, keep that in mind okay let's talk about the minnows uh, wire stock 545 images um, for video uh, sales were 15 images and that earned me eleven dollars and 71 cents big stock i earned fifteen dollars and 95 cents uh one two three rf i earned four dollars and 65 cents can stock i earned a dollar and that basically takes me to the end because my photo for me site didn't sell and Archangel didn't sell. So those are goose eggs all around. 
Uh, before I gave you my total, just want to say, if you get anything out of these videos, please subscribe, um, hit the like button, helps me out with the YouTube algorithm. Um, try to always be helpful. I, I know these are earnings report, but I do try to always include things that uh, can make your uh, Microsoft strategy better. So um, anyway, thanks for watching. Uh, and yeah, I would love your subscription. Uh, anyway, my total for the month of July was $783.24. So from my perspective, while that's lower than the past few months, for July, I think 783 is really, really good because the month usually is much slower, um, summer months generally. So yeah, super happy with $783. Um, Got a lot of content that I'm uploading right now from my summer vacation to uh, Spain and Portugal. So that's hopefully gonna give me a boost um, here in the fall. Anyway, thanks for watching. Uh, really appreciate your support over uh, the past few years on my channel. Uh, any comments, please leave them. Uh, always happy and uh, to hear from you. So take care and we'll see you on the next one.